We are back for some more Batman Arkham City. We're gonna take down. Um, what you call it? Death shot. third victim. It looks like he was hiding behind this car when he was killed. How did Deadshot do it? I think I found the link that connects Deadshot's victims. Good. He's killed again. We need to stop him. The first two both worked for Strange. The first victim was a specialist in wireless broadcast technology. He worked on the tower communication system. And the other one? I can't find any information about what he worked on, which is suspicious enough if you ask me. But he was previously contracted on military projects, specializing in advanced weapon delivery systems. Deadshot's clearing up Strange's mess. I'll track this shot to see if he left anything I can use to find him. Good work, Barb. It's Batman! He's kicking their asses! Get him! Oh, load this damn phone. What is the op? I only run out a few minutes. Make it go damn mind. My flesh is begging you to fail, Batman. Will you? Ring, ring. I saw... Oblivion. 
I saw that we are all the same, stuck on a miserable loop that demands salvation. So I gave it to him. God damn, there's a little bit more. Bullet hit here. That's how he did it. Dead shot ricocheted his shot off this shot. the shot Deadshot would have been lying down his body heat melted the snow there we've got him Oracle I've isolated a number of very distinctive plastic based particles and identified items that use this material in their construction so I see looking at the possible choices I assume you've decided on the power substations right Exactly. Cross-referencing this against locations that would definitely contain the metallic particles from the second crime scene gives us... Three locations. You've done it. You're actually gonna catch the son of a bitch. I've marked the map. I'll let you know what happens. Okay, let's go.
There's an electrical substation in this area. It could be the one Deadshot used. Deadshot was here. He was using this substation to store his equipment and... A PDA. It's heavily encrypted. I'll need to bypass the security if I'm going to find out any more about Deadshot and what he's doing here. This PDA was definitely given to Deadshot by Hugo Strange. It looks like he was smuggled into Arkham in order to take out a specific list of threats to Strange's position. Let's see. Deadshot only has three targets left. Jack Ryder, Bruce Wayne, and Batman. Damn. He's working to a schedule. Ryder's his next hit. He's marked his current location. He's going to kill him in three minutes if I don't get to him in time. Oh, shit. Jack Ryder in two minutes, Deadshot will kill him. What? You may be missed. That was the worst target, glitch I've ever seen. I never miss. Why are you hiding? Is it because you're dead already? <sighs> Stop hiding! I won't get your ass that shot. You want to try your luck? Go on then. Stop hiding like a baby and fight me. Where have you gone, Batman? Are you too scared to face me? You should. Nope. Cause I got back for him later.
No, that, oh my god. I'm ready to say. Can you imagine the vagrant's surprise when I grabbed his knife from his hands? It, it was instinctive. It was beautiful. In one movement, I sliced out his throat and gave him the gift of salvation. Found you. It happened so fast, but I felt every joyous sensation. The blood sprayed over my face and I saw what little life was left in his eyes. But then it was over. I felt lost. Like it had been meaningless. That no one would acknowledge my sacrifice. And then it happened. Without realizing what I was doing, I plunged the knife into my forearm and cut deep. It was incredible. I felt my body elevate to a higher place. It had become a temple to my work. Your mother won't wreck I should scan the crime scene to determine the cause of death. The attack left the victim bleeding profusely. The murderer is likely to have trace elements of the blood on them without realizing. The victim's face has been removed and the head wrapped in bandages. There have been three murders in Gotham over the last month with the same M.O. The press have nicknamed the killer the Identity Thief. If he's now in Arkham City, I need to track him down and stop him. I'll filter the scanner to track the victim's blood particles. That should lead me to the last person to see the victim alive, maybe even the killer himself. Why did you kill him? It wasn't me. I'm not a killer. I'm a plumber, for God's sake. You've got to believe me. I don't have to believe anything. Tell me what you saw. There was this guy. He dropped the body there. He was weird looking. You won't believe me, but, well, he looked like Bruce Wayne. What? I know. Someone must have got to him. He was covered in cuts and bruises, but I'm sure it was him. The poor guy must have a target the size of Gotham City painted on him. Looked like he'd been attacked by pretty much everyone in Arkham. There may be more victims of the identity thief in Arkham City. 
I should look out for them. Mm, excuse me. So we got somebody. Mm. Cut people's faces off. Looks like another victim of the identity thief. I need to scan the area to see if there are any more clues to his identity and whereabouts. The MO is the same as for the previous victim. First, the killer paralyzes the vocal cords and then removes the face before bandaging up the head. It's definitely him, and it looks like he's stepping up his attacks. A crime with this level of precision requires weeks of premeditation. These aren't just random attacks. Oracle, I've reconstructed a clean set of fingerprints, but there's no match to anything in the Gotham criminal databases. I'm uploading the prints to you now. Check these against every record in the country. Who do the prints belong to? You. These are Bruce Wayne's fingerprints. How is that possible? I have no idea. Bruce, I don't know how to say this, but... What's wrong, Barbara? I've been thinking about the identity theft case. Don't get angry. But how can you actually be sure that it wasn't you who killed those people? I mean, they were your fingerprints at the scene. What did you say? Not intentionally, but clearly you're not well. That place is full of maniacs who could take advantage of a situation like that. Think about it. What if Crane got to you again? You know Strange's reputation. Maybe he planted the idea back when you met him. I don't like it, but... It wasn't me. I'm sure it wasn't. Yeah, of course. I'm sorry. I just, well, you know. Another victim. Sooner or later, the killer will slip up. Let's hope it's this time. As with the others, the victim's face was removed pre-mortem with surgical precision. The care taken suggests the killer is more concerned with the parts he's taking than what he leaves behind. Someone has taken a lot of care to cover their tracks. They used bleach to destroy any forensic evidence at the crime scene. <laughs> bleach. Sometimes the lack of evidence is all you need. I'll filter for particles show. of the bleach, bleach and see who was so determined to cover their tracks. He's gonna find his bastard. 
Oh lord, more of this. Let's see. Oh, from far and right, it should be lead to. Why you kill him? You killed that man and dumped his body back there. Why did you take his face? It wasn't me. I just dumped the body. He told me to use bleach to clean it up. Who told you? Wayne, you know, the rich guy. You're lying to me. I'm not. There's an alley near the courtroom. That's where he is. He's crazy, man. You don't want to go in there. Okay, let's find who he is. Okay, this is just creepy now. This is the journal of Dr. Thomas Elliot. My work is complete. The pain, though still present, has been worth it. He will suffer for what he did to me. He will suffer way I have suffered. As I look in the mirror, I understand how Leonardo felt when he finished the Mona Lisa, how Michelangelo felt when David was complete. My work has taken too long, but now it's time for my masterpiece to be unveiled. My new face is ready. I couldn't have put it better myself. I take it you're here to stop me? What do you think? I think you're too late. You're a killer, a psychopath. I will stop you. Really? But you look just like Bruce Wayne. Yes, I am it Bruce took Wayne. Time, of course, to find the perfect donors, to graft on the flesh, and finally to lose myself in order to create this. Six people died. This is what I want to know. But necessary to complete. Did he my took his plan. own skin out too? Why would you believe good? Oh, he's running like a mask. Revenge? <clears throat> to be honest, I don't care if you do. Wayne will suffer, and you will not stop me. I can see you have your hands full with Arkham City, but it's time for me to leave now. Pray we Man, I'll see you in Arkham Knight. Next time. I will not be in such a generous mood.
close the file on the identity thief, Oracle? No. Prepare a new file on Dr. Thomas Elliott. I'm uploading all the details from his surgery. We were, a long time ago. He's gone. He's left Arkham City. I'll hunt him down tomorrow. <laughs>